Now, a £3 million fund is being made available to promote Scotland as a visitor destination to the rest of the UK and Ireland. With restrictions still in place for the majority of abroad travel, it's hoped Scottish attractions can capitalise on holidaymakers closer to home. Well, Kirsty Clark has spent the day at Loch Lomond Shores, where they're gearing up for a busy holiday weekend. This is one of Scotland's most scenic beauty spots and its destinations just like this the sector hopes to promote. Now this fund from the Scottish Government will be distributed by Visit Scotland in grants of up to £100,000 as part of the Covid recovery process. Groups will be able to apply for money to market regional destinations as well as group or individual attractions. Everyone is, is, is aware of the tough year that, that the tourism industry has had, um, you know, and the focus for us with this fund is about that short term uh, immediate recovery and, and the domestic market is, is the way forward for that. And working really closely and collaboratively with the sector groups and the destination organisations across Scotland will, will really give Visit Scotland the opportunity to help and, and work with them to develop visitor propositions that, that you know, that we know that, that consumers are looking for in, in a post COVID world. It is the holiday weekend and with good weather on the cards, businesses here are preparing for an influx of tourists. Of course, Loch Lomond is just half an hour from Glasgow where there is that travel ban. No one from the city should be travelling out with. But tourists from the rest of the UK have been booking up accommodation, filling the void of international tourists. Our bookings during the summer uh, are, are certainly there, you know, the b business on the books is, is way up to where it was in 2019. But I think this, this, this money will hopefully help us with the winter months when it can get a wee bit quieter uh, and promote, you know, the loads to do in Scotland. It's, a, it's, a, it's a, an all year round destination. It's got such a lot of things that I don't think we down in the south in England understand or even mm. appreciate. You know, the value of what you've got here, the surrounding hills, Ben Lomond, Loch Lomond, Mm. Every facility, it's just excellent. It's just, it's just beautiful, isn't it? The mm. scenery is just so, we just love stunning. it. Yeah, it is. It's Absolutely lovely. stunning. Uh, there's a lovely park and the, the loch, obviously, and a uh, nice wee village at Ballach. And, uh, plenty to do. We, we love, uh, love Scotland, love to visit here. And with the lockdown easing, we uh, thought we're going to have to do a staycation. And uh, Scotland's always been appealing uh, for us, so that's why we're here. Well, despite a bit of a cloudy start this year for the Scottish tourism industry, they're certainly hoping for a bright and busy summer of staycations.